Welcome to race 35 for the first race at the Cottenham Hunter Chases. We have five races to bring in for Cottenham. Start off with the two miles five. Kip Billy Danger, Smart and Leland, Carmacko, Falco, Hollywood, Lant Hansa, Pioneer, Mark Cooper, Ayan, Martin Leland, Everybody's Fool, Patrick Ogan. Orange Cassidy, Matt Cooper, Madame Marlene, Patrick Ogan, and Impanina de Moore, Alex Cherry. We are caught them today. It's in Essex. We are we in so far, just just a couple of yards up to the Cambridge, Cambridgeshire, and Newmarket in Chelmsford. It's not so far from here, Chelmsford City. The race course is near Cottenham. If you're wondering which part of the country we're in, we're all that side of the country, and it's uh, everybody's. Well, I say everybody's for was leading, but now Chamaco Falka has come for the ticket for the very uh, magnetic trainer of Derek Hinton, leads by a length. In second place is Ayan, who's on the outside, and comes. Uh, Back in third is Lanat Sa Pioneer, the Lanat Sa Pioneer stable companion Orange Cassidy, they'll jump that one. And Martin Leedon has two in this, uh, Patrick Organ has two in this, and Mark Cooper has two in this. Dell and Alex have one each. Um, I'll give you an update next week on the Enters Championship. I know I had two winners in the first week of the Enders and I have not had to chase it since because my horses don't qualify no more. The two that did qualify are both weighted above the restricted ratings so we probably have a new leader by the end of the day. And Charles Michael Polko, Derek Hinton over the ditch leads the pass by Aeon on the outside in the red rum colours and back in third is Everybody's Fool. Everybody's Fool is Lanasa Pioneer and then the second string of Martin Leedens runners as Capability Dangerous Capability? Oh, I don't know, Capability Capa Dangerous maybe. Oh, that one, they jumped that one as well and they got Marrow and a half or so just over to run and in uh, Trevor Hemmings colours with the Derek Eaton trained in Chamaco Falka yeah, he's been second it's everybody's fool and then keep keep pretty dangerous and their mistake by the grey on the inside the last time the pioneer that marker is now Madame um, Maylin Passing the little stand and cotton them, circuit ahead of them. It's a beautiful race course I made, isn't it? <laughs> I like making the old under chase courses, I had fun doing it. Some people sort of try and make some race courses, it's really fun. And then you see them when they built, and they, they are in the league, these under courses I built. It's good to see. Oh, yes. A good practice as well. Uh, Chamaraku Falka leads by a length from Everybody's Fool in second. On the other side is Ayan, Ayan. and then comes uh, Orange Cassidy and Nancy Pioneer, followed through by Capably Dangerous, Marlene and Marlene, and the back market now Impanina de Moor. I'm just going to have my speak of tea with six left to run. Right, we're still going to jump the next. And they're all still standing. They're going towards the five and a half marker now. And it's uh, still checking like a polka. Oh, of a rating of 100 is the top weight in the field. I've jumped this one. Just made it into the field actually. If he wins today, probably won't see him again in the entire day. We lost one. Uh, it was Madame Maylene, uh, Patrick Ogilvie, that went. And uh, they jumped the next one. 
They got just over three and a half left to run on Chamak out. Falco leads for Impania Demo, who's made some good ground on the outside in second. On the inside of him, Capely Dangerous is coming with another one. They're jumping that one and moving up very well is Impania Demo. And they jumped the next. Oh, we lost one there. And that time it was uh, Ayanna's gone, but it's still will make Capely Dangerous gone clear. This kick for home, Cutman's clear, everybody's full back in second. Ipanea, the Moors well has, has faded and he's dropped back to third, he's swinging in. They got this one fence and a small one into jump, do running. And Cape Lee Dangerous comes over, he jumps it by two for him, second place, everybody's full. Up towards the line, it's Cape Lee Dangerous holding everybody's full by about 11 and a half to two in second place. And a, a photo of third between the Matt Cooper, Pedro, and Slayer Payne, yeah. And Owen oh, Cassidy, and then Impania the Moor dropped away, tamely in the straight. The winner for Martin Leiden. And Cape is really dangerous. He was the top weight, sorry, of, of 100, so he probably won't see him around for a couple of weeks at least. Everybody's full in second for Patrick Hogan. Orange Cassidy was third. Uh, Stuart Lansar Pioneer.